Hey guys, Meyer here. Today I wanted to do a quick review and concept comparison of the newly hangar ready Reliant Core. Before we begin, it's important to take note that Star Citizen is still in early alpha development, and as such, all assets seen in this video are subject to change and are constantly being improved on. With that said, the Reliant Core is the third in the line of starter ships for Star Citizen and comes with two size 1 mounts for fixed weapons. It can be further modified by the addition of size 3 gimbal mounts for added firepower or the use of technical suites. This slot is covered in the core variants by a protective cap. Here are some examples of those technical suites from the concept art. The Reliant, with its panoramic cockpit which extends to the floor, offers by far the widest field of view than any other known ship in the verse. It is further set apart by not only the addition of a co-pilot seat, but the ability to transform into various flight configurations at will thanks to that ever mysterious Xi'an tech. From its exterior, the Reliant Core is a near flawless reproduction of its concept art. However, the specialized EVA rooms featured in the concepts of both the Research and Skirmisher variants, the Sen and Tana, do not make an appearance on the core. It would seem that the cargo hold of the core would have to be extended by at least a third of its length in order to accommodate that extra room. As far as the rest of the cargo hold, it appears that you would be hard pressed to find space for the specialized equipment that is featured on the other Reliant variants. However, it would not be surprising if for this reason, the other ships varied in size much in the same way as the ships in the current Mustang line do. One feature not alluded to in the concept works is the existence of access points, which may either serve as additional slots for technical specialization, or for other basic features not yet implemented such as life support, avionics, or even overclocking facilities. And that's the end of my Misc Reliant core review and concept comparison. All in all, I'm a huge fan of this ship and I feel that it's right at home as a starter ship and it will be great for those who like to play together either with a friend or an NPC. What do you think? If you want to see more videos like this, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you have any other ideas for any ships I should cover in the future, please do leave your input in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching.